السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. السلام عليكم. I will be speaking in Arabic and I will try to give you an image and uh, depict uh, the um, situation now because it is an opportunity to do so and I would like uh, as well to pay my sympathy to Jordan for what happened yest yesterday or these two days, especially with the climate change. And uh, I would like as well to tell you that uh, if we do not solve this problem of climate change, this will uh, lead to lots of catastrophes and lots of damages. Ladies and gentlemen, dear participants, I know that you want to listen to what you have seen yesterday regarding the visits, the visit that was paid uh, to the Sultanate by the President of the Palestinian Authority as well as the Pre Prime Minister of Israel. And we would like as well to tell you that we are very keen on telling you about what we can share because we consider that it is now a uh, time to start thinking seriously about how to put an end to the problems that do not allow the uh, countries of the region to really live up to the development that they really deserve. We consider that the Palestinian issue is the core of all the problems that we have seen during the second half of the last century and the 18 years of the 21st century. And we have also to see how can we solve this problem and to find a future for a new generation of young persons in this area who can really live with the other generations of this uh, world and for the towards the future. Based on this, we know, we understand, and we read that the state of Israel has become a state thanks to some circumstances after the Second World War. And now we see that the state of Palestine needs to be established because it has become a strategic necessity to get rid of what is called terrorism ignorance and delay. This is why, and based on this, we have started our modest initiative and efforts to uh, see all these opinions that can, we consider very important. But we are not mediators. We are not mediators in this issue. We offer facilitations, we offer ideas that may have some new, some novelty. This novelty that may help the two parties to be readier to go forward together in establishing the Palestinian state and achieving peace and stability, security, excuse me, and stability, and to give the opportunity to the countries of the area to get rid of their commitments towards issues that have become of the past. We think that the entry point towards the future requires from all parties and all sides to uh, get rid of the past and to let go of the past and to really cling to the future. This is why we are working within this context. I would like to tell you very clearly that we call, we request, and we affirm and confirm that the main role is mainly relying on the role of the U.S. and what will the uh, president, the U.S. president will be doing regarding the um, deal of the uh, century because we want this effort to be very successful and to lead to getting rid of all the problems that we have uh, faced recently or during uh, the 40, 50 years. 
so the Palestinian population all over the world have been suffering since 70 years. The same applies to the, to the Israeli population. And we need to understand that it is about time to stop talking about the past, a past that we cannot uh, transfer to the future. We need to give the opportunity to both these populations to work uh, in a friendly manner. This is why we are saying this, and we said this to all those who talk, we talked with, that establishing an independent Palestinian state is a strategic request. Without such a state, with all its pillars, we will not be able to reach any stability because the Middle East forces or the forces that are in the Middle East and in the Arab countries that are pessimistic finds, so these forces find some justification for violence. And thus, we should not ignore these issues. And here, I would like to tell you that if we follow this track, the entire world will be supporting us. And if we don't follow this track, if we remain as we are, we will not be able to expect from the world any assistance to keep things as they are and to go on with the sufferings of the Palestinian population, sufferings caused by this conflict. And here we are talking a passing from society to another, from a forum to another, while the Palestinian population remains in uh, thriving and uh, having problems because of this situation. So this is why we think that the Palestinians have made up their mind because the Israelis have made up their mind. They need to talk, to work together towards this future. I do not want to be lengthier. We will go on with our efforts. We will go on with the communication with both parties. And of course, we welcome any further efforts coming within the same track. We call upon everybody to give themselves an opportunity to think of the future and not to think of the past and the reasons of uh, the conflict in the past. I wanted to talk about this issue with all of you today and to be brief and to be as honest uh, and this with, with this honesty. Thank you.